Mobileversity and Billy Allsbrooks.com. Exclusive. From the moment you open your eyes, you gotta set the tone for the day. And the first question you need to ask yourself is, what am I gonna do to get better today? You see the great Lao Tzu said, mastering others is strength. But mastering yourself is true power. Now understand this. What you do consistently, you will eventually become. Therefore, your first objective on the road to success is to master and conquer yourself. One by one, you must overcome the daily temptations to stand in the way of your dreams. Now I want you to understand you have greatness in you God put it there But the only way you'll ever be able to access it Is by going through the gates of self-discipline You can't outsource self-discipline Self-control, self-mastery You gotta stop blaming everybody else For your own shortcomings If you wanna make progress You must address what I'm telling you right now now discipline starts in the mind It's rooted in your why And ultimately determines whether your dream lives or dies Now let's go to the word He that have it no rule over his own spirit Is like a city that is broken down and without walls You see the less discipline you have The more vulnerable you are And what you don't master will eventually master you. Most people spend all their time and focus on the external aspects of success and never address the internal mechanics that actually produce it. Your grind, your work ethic, that's your plane ticket up out of here. That's your only way out of mediocrity. Greatness can only be purchased with the currency of hard work. Now let's go back to my last message. Stop leasing success and own it. And what I mean by that, see on Monday, a lot of you out there, you're doing everything it takes. You're hitting it hard. You're going all in, 100, 120. On Tuesday, you're doing the same thing. You're going all in. You're doing whatever it takes. And then Wednesday comes and your discipline breaks down. And you give it all back. All the gains you made on Monday and Tuesday, you get back on Wednesday. Now Monday and Tuesday, you was driving a Bugatti. But the only problem with that is it was a rental car. And on Wednesday, you return that thing. So what I'm trying to get across to you is, success requires discipline. 24-7, 365, it means going 120 all out every day, no excuses. It's that simple. You got two choices you can make, embrace discipline or accept defeat. Simple as that. Now many of you walking around out there like you got all the time in the world. But here's the truth, you don't get a second chance at this. You don't get a second chance, I'm telling you. It's up to you. Success avoids the undisciplined like the plague. So it's time for you to arise, great warrior, and go be the person God made you to be. Now all of you out there with just average talent, self-discipline is the great equalizer. Hard work, discipline, that's the membership fee that filters out the weak from the strong, the losers from the champions, the average nobodies from the legends. Which one you want to be?